This is Kana of the family Kanesi. We will study this plant today in the taxonomy practice. Let us study Kanesi today and we will take Kana indica as an example. It is an ornamental herb which is grown in all gardens and it has a rhizomatous stem and it has got a pseudo stem with sheathing leaf bases. This is the uh, leaf with a sheathing leaf base and the leaf is simple and unicostate with parallel venations. You can see the parallel venation, the tip is uh, acute and they say it is uh, cirrhose, minutely cirrhose, the margin is entire. So this is the leaf with sheathing leaf base and this is actually the pseudo stem which is herbaceous, green, erect, aerial. So this is the racemose inflorescence which actually makes a spike and these are the individual flowers and you can see these are the uh, buds, young buds and this is a and this is an open flower. I'll just take out one uh, bud and open the bud and show you the different parts. It is inferior ovary, the ovary is inferior, you can see the uh, ovary at the bottom. This is the inferior ovary because all the non-essential parts are above the flower. The flower is bracteate. You can see this is the bracts and bracteoles and this is the ovary. The green color structure is the ovary. And these are the uh, tepals. There are uh, six tepals, two ovals of three each, which are, uh, and you can see, I'm opening the flower. You can see here, these are the tepals. So there are six tepals two holes of three each and uh, you can see these are the tepals one two three these are the inner tepals and these are the outer tepals so there are six tepals and uh, when it comes to the andrisium the andrisium in case of canna is uh, unique there are six stamens and uh, these six stamens are uh, actually modified to form the staminodes. So you have uh, three staminodes, this is staminode number one, two and three, three staminodes. Two other, the two inner anthers are fused to form a labellum. So this is the labellum, this is the labellum. And the innermost uh, anther is uh, forming half staminode and half fertile anther. So this is the uh, innermost stamen which is forming half staminode and half fertile anther and this is the uh, style and stigma and this is stigma of course we have the and of course this is the inferior ovary trichocleri, trilacula, syncarpus many ovules on axial placentation the outer surface of the ovary is warty that's why it's called warty ovary Thank you for watching my videos please like share and subscribe we'll meet again in the next video with some other topic thank you very much